if you guess, if you guess, you already see the performance something like that. How many subscriber he have in his YouTube? Just say number. There's so many talented people with nothing on YouTube. He probably has like 150 followers. 150, 150 followers. I just me because you're asking me. If yeah. Some of you no, no problem. No problem. No problem. Halo guys, welcome to Mon Prank Channel. Hari ini sudah bersama dengan teman saya, David. Dia adalah seorang gitaris ya teman-teman dan saya akan memperkenalkan Mas Alibata karyanya beliau ke teman saya David ini. Jadi kita akan kenal-kenal David sedikit dulu ya hari ini. David, how are you, dude? I'm not bad at all. Just out here playing some guitar. Wow, that's really really amazing. I mean like uh, David, maybe like can you telling with us about your experience in the music something? So I um I started off with a guitar teacher when I was nine. I'm 24 now. Wow. Um, started off with a guitar teacher. Um, two weeks in, I'm like I told my parents I don't want to mm. do this anymore. Um, I because like I, I didn't like having a teacher because I I, I didn't want to learn. Like hey, it's stupid. Yes. I don't want to I don't want to learn that stuff. Mm. Um, I, I really wanted to learn classical guitar when I first started out. But that kind of got abandoned because I learned how hard classical guitar was, and I still yeah. haven't learned it to this day. So I'm not like an inspirational beacon for anyone who's looking for a classical guitar tech. But I understand. yeah, regardless, um, I ended up starting uh, to like give more of a shit about music later on. Like when I was 13, I thought it was the coolest. I did the most embarrassing school talent show in middle school. Uh, that still keeps me up at night. So. Mm -hmm. If you're there right now, trust me, it, it it probably will get better. I can't tell you it will. Um, but yeah, no, ever since then, um, yes. played a lot of guitar in high school, played with mm -hmm. some uh, pretty famous people. Um, I uh, I never really had a band that took off. I kind of won some competitions in high school and then like okay. got the opportunity to play with some cool people. And then outside of that, now I just, you know, make bedroom rock. Oh wow, that's amazing. I mean like, where are you from dude? I'm from New York. Oh, New York. So, I mean like, how long you already been practice in the guitar? Something like that. What do you mean? Like, how long you already been practice in the everything? Like your stuff? Guitar, um, music, yeah. So, if I started when I'm 9 and I'm 24, how long is that? Is that 15 years? Wow. 15 years, oh my goodness. <laughs> Like you say before, you ever work with the famous people? I mean, like maybe like can you telling about that or something? I um I don't want to name drop by any means, but I guess one that I I'm really happy about is um mm -hmm. in high school I got the opportunity to play with the bassist from Blue Oyster Cult, which I thought was really cool. Yeah, we did um we did a cover of Black Magic Woman together. It's somewhere yeah. on the internet, or maybe my dad has it on his like iPhone 4 camera or some shit like that. Oh wow, that's amazing. <laughs> Jadi itu ya teman-teman. So uh, I mean like uh, what you do for the living right now? Right now I work in a restaurant. Oh, working in a restaurant. That's really a good. I mean like if I'm wanna ask the specific thing about what kind of genre genre you like it. What kind of genre is that? So I um I spent a lot of time in like mm -hmm. in like metal and hardcore, and then I realized the genre sucks ass, and I'm not having fun playing it, and I I can't play it in front of girls, and they would think I'm really? stupid. Yeah. So um, I ended up pivoting my whole genre into like um, kind of more like easy listening stuff. Like um, I think like this is this is one that I, I really enjoyed when I wrote it. Yes. Wow. stuff like that like a little bit more like a little bit less uh intense yes. stuff and then that kind of pivoted into like more of like a math rock thing where i was going like wow nice nice performer oh my goodness so guys you already see david play the guitar the performer is really really amazing so 
David, this is time for break now. Uh, before that, I wanna explain about my friend. His name is Ali Bata. He play guitar too, but about finger style. I just only wanna ask your opinion. What do you think about the technique or some things like that? Is that okay? Of your friend's guitar? Yes. So it, this is just like for break the interview for enjoy. You know what I mean? Oh yeah, sure. Yeah. yeah. So guys, before David reaction the video. So make sure guys yang belum memesan topi link admin sudah di bawah saya ciriakan langsung di order so this one <coughs> Throttling my my uh, my guitar with tapping bass notes, so like something more along this line, like a uh, like uh, here I'll show you if you'd like. So like using um using tapping to either play my bass notes or to use um or to uh, allow my other hand to tap the the melody. So like a. Mm -hmm. Finger style is defeated when you use a looping pedal. I feel like that, um, I feel like finger style in turn when you use something that you can pick up. Yeah, it must take a lot of practice. That's um, it's it's interesting how we use the looper. Uh, or I, I I don't know. I think using the looper with the tapping and then and then stepping away from tapping to use the looper 
Um, I think that's more of a demonstration of skill as opposed to like an, uh, a stylistic choice, which I could respect. I think that's cool. I think that's fair. But I, I think that the tapping was a little bit show offy if it doesn't really have like an inherent purpose, you know? Oh my goodness, that's so amazing. So guys, that's my friend David already explained with us and maybe like David, how we know about you, David? Maybe like you have Instagram or something. Oh so yeah, like my you. Instagram is Good Morning Baltimore. Here, I'll type it out for you. So guys, everybody watch this video. Please make sure guys check in the link description this video about David, my friend. He play guitar is really, really amazing. You already see this performance, guys. This is really amazing. Just check in the link description, David, Instagram, and make sure to follow him. Oh my All goodness. Right. So I just only want to explain with you, David. This is my friend. His name is Ali Bata. He a guitarist from Indonesia. I just mm -hmm. only explain like this because we use his video for our interview today. I mean like for break time, you know what I mean? So mm -hmm. if you guess, if you guess, you already see the performance, something like that. How many subscribers he have in his YouTube? Just say number. There's so many talented people with nothing on YouTube. He probably has like 150 followers. 150, 150 followers. I just hear me because you're asking me. If yeah. some of you no, no problem, no problem, no problem. Uh, this is his YouTube. Maybe like you want to check or something. I just only want to make sure. So maybe like you can enjoy the finger style too. Oh, wow. Five million. Confirm. Yeah, that one. That's the something crazy is about him. Oh my goodness. <laughs> David, thank you so much. Maybe like you want to say something for people watching you right now or something like some motivation uh, or something. Yeah, I mean, keep practicing. It's a, mm. it's a, it's a hard instrument until it becomes an easy instrument. And yeah. um, then it becomes like a, like a, like a, like a limb. Yeah. Um, and you're never going to want to stop. So if you're starting out, um, stick with it. Or if you don't like it, pick a different instrument, but play something. Mm -hmm. so much i'm really proud to meeting with you today guys make sure to check in the link description please follow my friend david instagram i'm already preparing the description make sure to follow him david Good once to meet again you guys. from bottom of my heart thank you so much already participates in my youtube thank, thank you, you so much thank you thank you so much see you next time brother see you guys all right